we're back in Geneva, which is not Lizark, which is not skiing, and it's only Friday, which means that something changed. There will have inevitably been an intro already, but we are starting off on vacation officially. We're here, we're having formage, cheese, meat, bread, and we gotta get our ski rentals and get out there to enjoy the Alps. the audio is not great, but it's so incredible out here. I mean, as my favorite YouTuber says, views on views, uh, but seriously, this is nuts. Um, I haven't eaten or drank anything today. I was teaching my dad and sister this morning, so we're gonna head to this little spot. They just have these on the mountain. Sorry I'm out of breath, I'm at like 2,500 meters, but look at this. And you can just pull up, get a beer and a snack. So I know the audio is not gonna be great, but basically this is Arc 2000. So I'm staying in 1800, you come over that ridge over there and I get to 2000 and 1950. So there's two villages and they have nicer spots like this to, to get a drink. Now the sun is coming down, as it comes down, I'm gonna go to my favorite Apre bar. I will take you there, don't worry. For now, a little hand sandwich and a nice midday beer to rehydrate. Cheers. Guys, it's Apre time. Look who I dragged out. Let's go get a beer. Hey everyone, what's going on? We meet you at uh, the end of our first day here skiing in Lazark. Now this vlog is a little bit different than most of the vlogs. So if you watch for the good storyline and the progression and things about medicine, this is probably not the vlog for you. But if you wanna see some really cool, just adventure content, travel content, ideas for your next trip, then definitely follow along. In fact, we're about to go eat my favorite meal. I will show you what it is in the French Alps and one of my favorite meals in the world. An incredible day of skiing, I'm pretty beat. We went to an Awesome happy hour with a DJ. You saw all of that already. And so we're gonna go get some really good dinner now. And this vlog is just gonna be fun. It's gonna be drone footage and B-roll and me skiing and some behind the scenes and ideas if you ever wanna come to Lizark. So if you enjoy that, give it a thumbs up and stick around because this dinner is gonna be amazing as is the rest of the trip. Leah, what food are you gonna try right now? Raclette. What, what, is, what is raclette? Raclette is a big old wheel of cheese that's cut in the center or something. And then it's heated up, and then you scrape it's it down. Melted. Yeah, yeah. Heated up and melted onto a plate of whatever. Meats, potatoes, little baby onions, pickles. Your hands, if you're bold. That's aggressive. Dad, what are we gonna eat? Raclette. All right, at least he knows the name. We're gonna see how he likes it. We'll get the one bite. That's how this trip's been going, so we'll see. Any words of wisdom? Yeah. Um. I feel Eat like maybe this is not on, but I do have words of wisdom. The camera's rolling. Okay. Rule number one. That sounds like no wisdom. If you were wise enough to get the wisdom, you got it. All right. At Lysburg. Dad's not sure where we're going, but we're going to Lysburg. All right, we're here. I'm excited.
we didn't do the one bite, so you get the after review. One scrape. After review, one scrape. What's the rating on Reckless? Knocked my hat off. So good. Number? You know, like nine. Everything's a nine for her. No. Number? Um, I'd give it uh, eight and a half to nine. Oh, a little less than I thought. I love Reclet. 10 out of 10 for me. It's light. It's delicious. I don't know where we went, but it's on the second floor of 1800 near Hotel Golf. Check it out. All right, crazy hair, end of day one. Welcome to Lezark. I hope that you enjoyed this. There's gonna be more drone footage tomorrow, more cool video because I'm bringing my drone with me, I think. So stay tuned for that because we have three days of skiing here and that was only one day. We will catch you tomorrow. In an update on the vlog, you may note that we're in a different area. And if we go outside, I don't know if you can see that, but we're back in Geneva, which is not Lizark, which is not skiing, and it's only Friday, which means that something changed. Well, as I'll show you now on the screen as best we can, I didn't want to take video earlier because obviously family's most important and getting things taken care of was what mattered, but my dad had some swelling in his eyes, wasn't feeling good at the altitude, and so we made the decision to leave. So unfortunately we left early, but we're in Geneva and we're gonna make the most of it. And we're starting off by enjoying a $100 kebab. If you have never been to Switzerland or had the pleasure of blowing all of your hard-earned money on food here, it costs something like 20 US dollars for Pringles. And this kebab itself was over $20. I think it was like $22. And when you factor in having a Coca-Cola with it and uh, three of them delivered to the Uber Eats, it came out to 92 francs, which is almost $100 US. So you can see my dad is quite alive and well sister as well. We're gonna enjoy some kebab, which you will see the delicious $100 nature in a second, but that's the change of plans, that's the update, so now we're gonna hang out in Geneva. Now, what is that swelling? I don't know, I'd call it periorbital edema. Now the bleed is just a subconjunctival hemorrhage and when you take a blood thinning medication, they can look a lot worse. So I don't think that's the problem. It was the swelling that kind of freaked me out. With shortness of breath and swelling, I decided it was time to go to a lower altitude. So to reflect on how we got physically here, this was the story of the travel. Our initial reservation was to travel on Sunday. However, we obviously needed to move that. So I had to call the company, mainly French speaking, get our transfer switched. We got it to 5.30 PM. Then I had to call IHG, shout out to them. And the fact that one of my cards gives me platinum status with them, we were able to actually get a room even though they were sold out and get two rooms for the two nights that we would need here in Geneva. So we kind of hit all those moving parts, checked out of the Airbnb, returned the sheets, the keys, everything else that we had from there. And then finally got on our three hour bus ride to get back here. In short, it wasn't easy. Geneva. So we are going to head downtown today, doing a lot of fun stuff. We're going to the famous flea market. We're going to take you to some really cool watches. Maybe we'll find something we like and uh, get some chocolate and a whole bunch more. So stick around if you want to enjoy a, a nice sunny day in Geneva. My sister loves to try McDonald's in all the different countries. So we're headed in right now. Here we got chicken paprika, veggie paprika. Anything else? You gonna comment at all? Chicken wing salads, chicken tenders. We'll try a chicken wing, we'll see how they are. We've got the food, let's break it open and see what it looks like.
All right. I'm trying to wing. There we go. It's actually really good. It's salty. It's good. Crispy and a lot of meat. Got nothing bad to say. What about you? Very good. Quite good. You heard it. Leo, the people of YouTube need to know, what? where are we going to next? We're going to get chocolate. What kind of chocolate? Swiss chocolate. We're going to get Swiss chocolate. <laughs> Outside, we got our chocolate. Leah's gonna take the first. Nope, Dad's gonna take the first bite. No, no, you. I've, I've had it. You try it. Let's catch the reaction. Hold on, Leah. We'll get yours too. What do we think? Pretty amazing stuff. Amazing stuff. Wow. <laughs> Could be habit forming. It's dangerous how good it is. Yes, good as I remember. My sister doesn't know this, but we're going to get her a YSL bag. Because she doesn't really buy anything super fancy for herself or super nice. So we're in Geneva, it's kind of like a designer capital, and I think it'd be really nice. So we're going there now, she doesn't know. Where are we on the way to? Tobacco more? Tobacco more. Tobacco more. Actually, we at YSL. We're going to a tobacco store. No tobacco store. All right, we'll find you in. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not buying anything. Come on. What's up? So what do we think? I'm gonna, Josh, I'm gonna beat his ass. Don't add that in. <laughs> it's like half my rent anyway. It's just too much. I'm gonna barf. I'm gonna throw up all over the place. Uh, I think we do have what you want. What do you want, by the way? Uh, freedom from this moment. Freedom from this moment. Inescapable. Alright, we just got out. What'd we get? I got a wallet. What is it? I got a wallet. All right, congrats. Thank Welcome you. to the bougie side. Thank you. Aw, how nice. First unnecessary bougie product. I gotta rub off somehow. It's nice. It commemorates this trip to Switzerland and you France. Earn it, you earn it, you wear it, and it. So now that we're all bougied up, and we missed my watch shopping earlier for the record, I got a Tissot, I really like it. It's kind of like an AP or maybe a Petit Philippe, one of the Nautilus ones. Um, but either way, I got that, I really like it. And now we're going to go get a beer, which will hold us over to getting ramen. Questions, comments, concerns? And we're off. Add that to the list of things that I will likely never be able to afford. What's up everyone? It is the next day. We've had a great trip here. It's our last day. Switzerland is quiet on Sundays. We don't have much to do. We just got back from our test. I think I got a little b-roll, but it was a do not film zone, so I couldn't get a lot. I want to thank you for watching. This has definitely been a different vlog. If you enjoyed, please give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. And if you want to see a quick outro montage, I think we're flying a really cool plane tomorrow, so I'll catch some footage. But otherwise, we will see you in the next vlog. Thanks for watching. I've always wanted to fly business class, so I pooled my points and got to do this from Geneva to the US. Here's the lounge in Geneva. The food was actually really good and they had beer on tap that you could pour yourself. We boarded our flight, which had decent food, but it was just kind of like a US-based first class. 
Can you guess this airport? This is the beautiful Heathrow and the lounge was incredible. I mean, you could literally pour your own scotch or wine or whatever it is you want. Now here is the good part of the video. This is my first full lay flat business suite. That smile is genuine because this seat was incredible. I even had my own door. It was like a mini apartment on the plane. Of course, champagne before takeoff and we were in the air. Dinner was delicious. It was a pot roast that was actually really flavorful and the sides were awesome. After dinner, I decided to catch some sleep, which was a great choice before arriving in Chicago.